read the latest statement from the JBP, mm -hmm. they have acknowledged that they have been tampering, they have been hacking, and the device have been compromised um, at four o'clock yesterday morning. I mean, uh, four o'clock this morning before we started. So, regardless of whatever the outcome, you know, there is no way that we could accept the uh, result because it's been compromised. <laughs> oh, sorry, I helped. Because the data wise is being compromised. So, yes, um, uh, we have to wait for the decision of the uh, of the election commission whether there will be uh, re voting or not. I, I don't think, um, given how I mean, the strongly worded statement by JPP, by the election committee, it was very strongly worded statement. It talks about how the device has been compromised. It talked about there has been an intrusion into the system. Um, I don't think that the result for Jula, whatever the result will be accepted. So it's almost certain um, that there will be a rebooting. I'm just not sure whether anyone has the energy for a rebooting. That's all. So there has been suspicion all along. But now with confirmation in July today, at least I think uh, regardless of what, what is the outcome within a week's time, because it has to conclude within a week, um, at the very least I think it provides some comfort. And I think what the party members would like to see is that we go to the bottom of this. That's more important, I think, than, uh, than the actual result itself because we need to defend um, our value system in Pekin.